try to imagine a world with little to no previous bias in education learning. A situation in which a real-world scenario has yet to occur to influence one's views or ethics towards a future decision. A world in which unfamiliarity is the actual tool used to help guide students towards forming future ethical frameworks. In a course offered at the University of Kentucky and the University of Illinois at Chicago, professors have developed a new, descriptive approach to teaching students computer ethics. So join us as we sit down with Judy Goldsmith at the University of Kentucky, where we share an exciting inside look into how to teach computer ethics through science fiction. Fiction allows students to step back from their immediate personal concerns and think about a world in which they have no stakes. So it allows them the distance from what's actually going on in their lives and their world on the other hand, it deeply immerses them in the world. In today's political climate, an outlet to an unbiased source to help formulate opinion on ethical issues is needed, and science fiction does just that. It's neither their own lives nor things coming out of the news where they are already primed for political reactions. It's something new, it's something separate that they can enter into fully enter into the experience of somebody from a different culture or a different class or a different setting, whether that setting is New York or outer space. By taking a descriptive approach to teaching ethics within computer science, it allows students the opportunity to focus on decision making rather than an outcome from a past experience. The aim of the course is to get students to analyze the ethical, societal, and personal implications of computer technology. If we can make it, we should, is a message many of them get from computer science and engineering education. And we're saying sometimes, whoa, think about that. Taking a descriptive approach to teaching ethics teaches the students to think about decision making rather than to think about specific issues and to analyze what they're doing in terms of ethical frameworks, in terms of what would be the utilitarian outcome, what would be the virtues that would support making this decision or another decision, and how can I best practice those virtues. Being able to draw on memorable class discussions is what course instructors hope helps students most when evaluating decisions within their future career choices. One of the things that I have always hoped is that by choosing really good stories, they will be memorable, and the discussions in class will be memorable, and the students will be able to draw on both what happened in the story and what happened in the classroom, perhaps when they even disagreed with their classmates or their professor, and draw on the kind of arguments that were convincing to push back against unethical choices. In some of our stories, the students get deeply involved with the ethical questions, deeply emotionally involved. Future ethical issues and what is yet to come are widely discussed, yet not always understood. While we must brace for future ethical decisions, some are already upon us. Targeted advertising, privacy, robots that kill, biases in data that's used for machine learning that leads to social programs, such as ones that decide who gets out on bail or decides which phone calls to a child welfare office get followed up on. Although dealing with sometimes emotionally involved topics and issues, developing an ethical framework through science fiction allows for a perfect mixture between seriousness and fun. A mixture that allows students and instructors the opportunity to learn from each other. This has been the most fun I've ever had teaching. It's fun because of the material, it's fun because I'm learning new stuff, which I often do in courses. And it's fun because I get to know the students in a way that lecturing about the programming of this or that does not enable. I get to know what their values are and to engage with them about those values and support the importance of having those values. And I have uniformly loved my students. They tell me in what ways they are ethical. And how can you not love students for that? 
I recommend this to anyone. Find out more in How to Teach Computer Ethics Through Science Fiction, a contributed article featured in the August 2018's Communications of the ACM.